Oh, hello. Quantum Pilly. Oh, double. <laughs> oh, no. We've got a double. <laughs> G'day, guys. It's your boy, Nat Shonky Sharton, and you're back for another episode of Fisherman's Diary today. Sean and I are hitting Wellington Point. Kind of Wellington Point. More Birkdale than anything. Oh, it's a muddy, muddy area, but that's just because we've picked the worst fucking possible tide to do it in. Oh, good thing is it gets deep nice and quick. All right, well, we're in three and a half. We're right in the middle of the channel. We're heading straight down to the open water. We're gonna find three, at least three meters of water, I would think. Put a shark rod out, fish some lighter stuff. Um, any goals for tonight, Sean? I uh, just catch a fish, mate. Catch a fish? That's goal. Pretty good goal for a fishing channel, I reckon. I mean, I don't need to be able to talk to you. Gonna be able to hit the uh, the stuff around the, the fish around the mark is pretty good from here, though. Unweighted prawn. Nice, Sean. He's got one. It's a flatty. You beauty. Unweighted. Unweighted flathead. Look at this. This is fucking flathead. Out. Unweighted fishing. It's an underrated sport, guys. I'm telling you. Snapper. Yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. That's the way, bro. Oh, yep, he's there, he's there, he's there. You! That's a good fish! Oh, baby! Come on, unweighted prawn! Done the trick, and that's a good fish. That's run quickly. I wonder what that is. I'm gonna find out. It's heavy. Oh, yeah, that's a good fish. Stay on, please. Oh, no, has he dropped it? He has too. Oh, he's dropped it. Come back for it. Come back for it. Missed it. No. Oh, yep. Fish on. Got him. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Hello. On some pilly. Oh. Double. <laughs> oh, no. We've got a double. Oh, shit, dude. I'm, I'm, I've got a double hookup, Sean! Uh, whatever this is, is a fucking... Oh, no, that one's come off, I think. Oh, fuck, that's right. Probably best to lose one of them. Whatever this is, is a tank. Oh, shit. Alrighty, well, worst case scenario then is keep that fish on, line this in. Where are we? We can't be too far, can we? Surely not. That fucking sinker, I can't believe how high up that's come. That's as annoying as it gets. We've got to watch this pole here. This has been an incredible fight. We're just here. What do we got? Whoa! What's that I've no idea what that is, eh? That kind of looked like... Oh! A shark's tail almost. What do we got? Oh! No way! I think it's just a big smelly catfish. Tell you what, it's a good fight. I'll, I'll pay him that. I still haven't seen him properly. Oh my god, it's a good fight. Six pound line. And he's not uh, given us an inch. Look how far away I've drifted already. Holy shit. If we see it and it is a catfish, then we can leave him be for a minute. Or we won't be so aggressively winding this in. What have we got? Here we are. No! It's not a catfish, it's a shark! Hammerhead! Yeah, mate! 
Oh, he's just fucking out of it. If you just chuck us the net, I reckon. Straight up, just four. Fucking, if it gets even near the kayak, I'll be able to get him pretty quick. Oh, if you can kayak over right now, that's perfect. Come on, baby. Yes. Yeah. You beauty. You got the net, I'll grab you. Little hammerhead shark. Right on dark, out at uh, Wellington Point. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen, and I'm so pumped about that. I tell you what, he's not very big, but man, I can imagine one of the big ones how they fight hay because oh, go, man, that thing went absolutely mental, and that is not a big fish by any means. Well, guys, the really cool thing about having an anchor that you can drop away from so easily is you can fight a fish like that, take a little bit of time, and then just come back and anchor straight up to exactly where you already were. Um, I really do love that setup. It's probably my favorite part about this kayak. All right, time for the shark rod to come out, guys. Now that we've caught a shark on a rig that we weren't really meant to catch a shark on. I'll let that sink do its thing. Yeah, I can feel it hitting it. I can literally feel it hitting it. I don't think it's a shark though. If it is, it's not a big one. Yeah, that took all of three minutes. Yep. Yep. Holy shit, what? I don't think it's that big, eh? Holy shit, Sean. Yeah, let's go. Full anchor. It is actually all right. You wouldn't fucking believe it. It was out for all of two minutes. I must have, eh? Well, there is legit a school of sharks that, and we were right. There's a chance of that too. Holy shit. I just hope this hook stays in, cunt. Holy shit. You wouldn't believe it. <laughs> oh no. Nah man, I'm off anchor, but my light rod just went screaming. Can you come up the uh, the left of me? I might need you to wind that light rod in. This is a really weird fight, eh? I'm not sure that this is... I think this might be a Wobbegong. I reckon it is, eh? No, 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 no! Oh, he's let it go! Holy shit. Well, I was just winding this in, guys, to check whether I had bait, and uh, this thing's eating some pilchard. I don't know what it is. It was just sitting there. I'd say it's probably a brim. They do that sometimes because they're fucking stupid. But I'm hoping it's a flatty. It's definitely not a stingray because he's shaking his head. And he's telling us no. And now he's swimming under the kayak. And I'm worried about the anchor rope just a little bit. He doesn't feel massive, but he's all right. Actually, it might be a little stingray. Ooh. Let's try and muscle him up, have a look at our fish. Six pound line, 10 pound leader on this one here, guys. Using a little stumpy. It's really fun to use from the boat, uh, the kayak and boat because you can kind of just uh, do whatever you want with it, treat it like shit and it always comes good. No, those are head shakes, this is the fish. A good little fish too, actually. Fighting pretty hard. We're gonna find out what he is very soon. Here we go. Keeping low. What do we got? Oh shit! Some fucking big ass pike eel. Woo! He swum it directly behind the kayak. Very, very strange. It's all happening tonight. Love this spot. Always some kind of action. Now, where is this going? Oh, 
Yep, yep. Oh, no way. No way. Oh, yep, 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 yep. On, on, on the shark rod. On, on the shark rod. Hook's in? Yep, hook is in. He swam that side of the kayak, dude. On, on the shark rod. On, on the shark rod. He swam the other side of the kayak. That's so fucking bizarre. Stay in there. Oh, I keep that hook in his mouth. He's just here. Oh, he's let it go again. What the fuck, dude? No. Oh, I think that feels alright. So worried it's going to come out again, eh? <laughs> out it comes. Oh no, never mind. Whoa, he came. He came back for it and ate it beside the kayak. We're on. He's just down here. Yeah, we got... Oh, you're fucking me. <laughs> Have a guess. It's a fucking huge pike eel. <laughs> a mammoth pike eel. Holy shit. Oh. Oh, my... God damn. Hey? No. Oh. I might just leave him on for a life bait. <laughs> fuck, he's pretty much fucked. Oh, no, he's not. Never mind. Oh, fuck. No, he's not. Never mind. All right, we freeze for him. Oh, fuck. No, he's not. Never mind. All right. This is going to be very hard to do. <sighs> Gotta get the... All right, hook is out. There's our pike eel. We did it. We fucking managed it. Now, what to do with it from here? All right, team. We're heading inshore now, looking for some brimbos because I'll tell you what, it's been quiet for brim. It's been quiet for finfish largely today, actually. Ah, oh, a bit weird, but that's right. The, that, that helped. Could you turn it back on, please? You fucking dickhead. Hopefully we can find a couple brimbos and be on our bikes. And hopefully Sean dies. Hopefully. I'm gonna cast straight at Sean right now and see what happens. How many friendship points do I lose if I cast this at your kayak? <laughs> well then it doesn't matter if I lose them, does it? Heads up. Oh. Is it tangled? No fucking way. I did not see that coming. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, shark rod is go. I'm also going to cast this at Sean. <laughs> How hard did Blake hit his head on the sink last night? Yeah. I mean, he's dropped it. No, nah, he's, he's there. He's there. He's there. Fish on. Okay. Unweighted prawn. That's alright too. Yeah, that's a pretty good fish. Now, we need to be praying. Praying. Oh no, he's just fucking... Oh no, he's still there. Uh, he's still there, I think. Has he let it go? Yeah, he's still there. He's swimming towards us. Alrighty. Yeah. Well, if the hook's in now, surely it's staying in. I reckon this is probably a catfish. We've gotten to, we've gotten a few species down tonight as well, eh? Napper, flathead, parkour, uh, hammerhead, catfish. What's that, like 17? Yeah. It's not bad, not bad. All right, this might be a stingray even, look at this. Maybe it is a stingray. Although, unweighted prawn in three meters of water. I'm hoping it's not a stingray. I kind of want to try and get... Oh my days. 
think he's, he's figured out what, oh, yeah. I think he's figured out what's going on now. <laughs> Oh no, he's done me. I hope the hook's just come out. How has that snapped me? He ran on that drag for so fucking long. Holy shit. Maybe that wasn't a stingray. My leader is in a bad way. A bad way. What the fuck? Tell you what, he's moved your kayak a bit, eh? Yeah, I'm going Powerful little fish. Oh, maybe it is just a forky, and I'm saying shit. Is it a cobbler? Yeah. It is? It is. Yeah, fucking sick, dude. They're such cool fish. Nice. That's a fucking hell of a cobbler, dude. I don't know, eh? Yeah, I think so. Fuck, he might have eaten it if it is a pike eel. No. Got him. Up him. Ooh, I don't know. I'm not gonna say much yet. Hey, it's not running. I think it is a pike eel. Fucking tell you what, it's another big one if it is a pike eel. Fish on. There's no fight here whatsoever. Here we go. Yeah, that looks like a pike eel, mate. Good shit. Yeah, mate, another pike eel. Holy shit. Jeez, he's not even that big, bro. He is so fucking wrapped up. It is incredible. Dude, look at this. This is some bonded shit. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> I feel bad for the poor gun. Oh, well, that's pretty easy. Yeah. Something, I reckon it's a porcupine fish. Oh, it is too, mate. It's a porcupine fish. Like a legit one. Yeah, one of the ones where if he fucking gets you, you are in for a pretty bad day. I only caught one of these here before. I only caught one of these ever. Actually, that's a lie. I've caught one before, way before I was filming this show. They're actually a very cute fish, despite being, obviously, um, big danger fish. But, um, yeah, super cool catch. You gotta love weird shit like that, honestly. Never, ever against catching cool stuff like that. That is so sweet. <laughs> Fucking all blown up. The hook is out. This fish is okay. He's just puffed up. How do you make them unpuff? Yeah, that sounds that sounds a bit. Just... He's trying to swim, but he can't because he's all he's all got air in him. Pop up when you had it. Looks like me with a bit of fucking KFC in my gut, bro. Fuck, how good does that sound on the way home? KFC. Oh, any... oh. oh shark KFC, haven't they? Nah, KFC's still open, gun. Yo, that's so sick. Guys, have a look at what Sean's just hooked. What the fuck? Oh yeah, nah, I wouldn't be touching that, eh? No, you can't. I mean, you can if you're a real yeah. if you're a real man. Wait till he proper flares up, cunt. What the fuck? What is this? I don't know, but I don't like it. I'd be I'd be saying goodbye to the hook, eh? I am. Right. Alrighty, guys. I did forget to do the outro again. Hope you all enjoyed the episode. Um, it was long. Yes, twenty plus minutes. Apologies, but sometimes when you're fishing at night, kayaking, the, the fights take so long to get fish in. You want to put as much content in as possible. So apologies if it was a bit long this time. 
try and keep it a bit shorter next time. Wasn't enough to cut her into two, though. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I'll catch you in the next one. Song of the day I have it prepared here because my memory is pretty average. Uh, is uh, later scripts and chanson d'automne. It's a French band, and I'm not very... I'm very bogan, so I can't pronounce it, but... Nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed the outro, and I'll catch you in the next episode of Fisherman's Story. Mm-hmm.